no more. I've been delivered. I've been delivered. and we're back in my bathroom you hear the echo I'm just playing I have not used deodorant for the past month and guess what I do not smell bad I am not known as a stinky person at work I have chosen not to use traditional deodorant since around November yes and I've been off and on doing this depending on what items are available in my area so I chose to stop using deodorant in particular I was going to Dollar Tree and I was buying the um, Dollar uh, Secret or I was using a degree things like that and I always buy the travel size so I was always traveling around I really began to research and look at the ingredients and the aluminum that is in traditional deodorants that is not a good um material to introduce to your body it has some adverse effects of course i'm going to advise you to do your own research and you decide what you're going to use for you and your family from there but i decided that that ingredient in deodorant was not for me so i experimented with a few different deodorants i use the crystal um, it's, it's called the crystal and I found that in Hawaii when I lived there and I used that and at times it did work but I had to actually have it in the shower because it is a dry rock crystal and you have to wet it to activate it and then you apply it underneath your arms and my crystal at times it got really jagged so when I would put it on it would actually cut me and it hurt so I wasn't really a fan of the crystal great concept and they also have a roll on I used the roll on for a while and that was pretty good as well. After I tried the crystal, um, I went back to using regular deodorant for a little while, but then I still, I did not feel good each time I applied that underneath my arms or bought that for my family. So instead, I went and I started using the Tom's um, deodorant. And Tom's deodorant, it, it has some of the pros was that it is widely available. You can find it at Walmart. It's for a decent price. But the thing of it is, it broke me out. Yes, my underarms were raw. It was like I was just spraying straight alcohol and everything that burns <laughs> underneath my arm. The lavender scent was cool though, but I could not use that for a long time. Then, um, experimented some more I didn't find I forgot what it was called but it was like an African deodorant and I found that at Walmart in Hawaii but I forgot what it was called and I can't I couldn't find it when I moved back to the mainland so I had absolutely no clue what it was called but it was kind of pricey I did find it at Walmart and um, it was about seven dollars for a tube but it was worth it it smelled great and it actually worked for a little while because you know over there it's summer all year long so you're constantly on sweat mode then after that, I switched back to regular deodorant for a little while, and then I started using this here. This is the Jason brand tea tree uh, deodorant. The pros is it does not contain aluminum. Um, the first three ingredients is, let's see, oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna need some glasses. Oh my gosh, hold on. The first ingredient is propanediol, if I pronounced that right. Water, glycerin, sodium, stearate, zinc, and I know I went beyond, you know, the three, but that is what is in the Jason brand. However, I still smelled bad. I smelled like whatever scent this was and some funky underarms <laughs> when I use this. So I went back to using regular deodorant, and then um, when I was in Cincinnati, I believe I posted this on Facebook or Instagram maybe, but um, I was at Kroger and I found this here, Naturally Fresh Roll-On Deodorant. And what I really liked about this is that it's a roll-on deodorant, it's hypoallergenic, paraben-free, fragrance-free, but then it also lists in very bold letters no aluminum chlorohydrate and that is the ingredient that i am trying to avoid because i read some not so good things about aluminum chlorohydrate yeah so um i have been using this it, it has kept me you know smelling good you know and things like that now what i discovered is that you're supposed to sweat okay you are supposed to sweat that is your body's natural cooling system and also that is a way to flush out some toxins things like that is in your body i told you about this in another video where i was applying a exfoliating lotion to my body and i was applying it to my legs 
However, I noticed a couple days later that my underarms began peeling and exfoliating really bad. So what we put on our skin and what our body does, our body is so smart that it processes these things out through our armpits and other various elimination systems on our body. Our body is brilliant, okay? I have since stopped using the naturally fresh deodorant. Nothing bad to say about it, nothing bad at all. But however, sometimes I did sweat. It did, it did have a, a expiration time. So what am I using now? What I'm using now, it legit keeps me smelling like just absolutely nothing from shower to bath to shower to bath, bath, shower, whatever. And you know what, you wanna know what it is? You wanna know what this, what this item is that I've been using that costs pretty much nothing. And it keeps me fresh, shower to shower, gym, a whole day of working, sweating, hustle and bustle, everything. Are you ready? Drum roll please. The lime. Yeah. Yes, the lime has just a plain old lime. And it's it's just a lime. I got it, I think, you know, at Costco. I did get the organic bag this time. It, it has seeds, it's good to go. And yes, all I do is take a lime. Oh, let me tighten up my towel. I get a lime. I kind of rub it between my hands or across the, the countertop, you know, get the the lime juice activated or whatever, or the activation, but I saw it on the Food Network where they're like, yeah, you know, get the juices going. So yeah, slice it in half, and then I take that half, and I just rub it underneath my arms. Boom, boom, boom. That's it, I take that half that I've used, I put it in the freezer, I take the other half, I freeze it, and I have deodorant for like a week and a half or until it dries out, and then when I'm getting out to that last little bit, I just take it, squeeze it all into a bowl, and just take my fingers and apply it, then at the same time, I'm taking the other half out the freezer, put it in the refrigerator. When I get ready, lime it up. And that is it. Your body, <laughs> your body is thanking you for not putting these extra toxic chemicals in, in there and you're stopping your body, your sweat glands, you're stopping your body from sweating out some things that you need to get out. You're supposed to sweat, you're just not supposed to smell bad. The lime, what that does is it neutralizes the bacteria that is coming out and it helps it to not smell bad. Like this is amazing. This is my deodorant. This is my deodorant. What I've read about aluminum chlorohydrate is that they have found it. Now, as I said, you know, do your research, but it has been found in, you know, breast cancer tumors and cysts, this ingredient is no bueno, no bueno. Don't use it. Make sure you try this, okay? You go to the store, you see a deodorant, you use your natural deodorant, and you call it a day, okay? You smell good naturally. Let your pheromones be released into the atmosphere. This will just cut down on cost. I'm buying commercial deodorant that doesn't do shit for you. And then you go out and have to buy, you know, these scent boosters for your laundry and you're wasting money. You're just dumping money down the drain, flushing it down the toilet, okay? You don't need those things. Your body will be naturally and i don't want to steal from this brand but yeah you can be naturally fresh with no repercussions okay no aluminum chlorohydrate in your body no chemicals your body was born without that you don't need it okay so yes i just got the shower i'm gonna go get dressed and i'm just like struggling making sure this towel didn't fall down but yeah your girl ain't used deodorant the whole month or so and i smell good make sure you give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel leave me a, a positive comment let me know if you tried this or if you have been using the lime or any other deodorant product that I mentioned or yeah deodorant or because it's not supposed to be anti-perspirant because you're supposed to perspire I'm feeling smart with my glasses on y'all really am all right subscribe like share comment join me on my other social media platforms and I will see you on the next video